Well, folks, let me step back and have you take a look at this tree. Every year, it's our annual tradition, as it is for millions, millions of people all over the world, celebrate Christmas. And so here's our, our Christmas tree as the lighting adjusts. But uh, let me just tell you something. It doesn't... Um, <laughs> It doesn't always turn out this well. It can be quite frustrating. This is the uh, the end result, if you will. But um, mm, as you know, in life, the end result, uh, let's put it this way. It's a long and winding road sometimes to get uh, to what you want. But hey, look at that. I oh, love the patriotic ornaments, don't you? How nice is that? All right, hang on, I'm going to explain. So to get this tree that way, with the help, of course, of Gracie, I mean, it is just, th this can just be, a in fact, what it reminds me of. These Christmas lights, the tangles. I remember reading a quote years ago. They said, if you can get through a Christmas season putting up lights, whether it's indoors or outdoors, without hurting anybody, well that's the sign of a true man or a true woman, whatever you want to say. And I certainly know what they mean. But this year, for some reason, every time I put a set up, another set would blow out. And I was getting frustrated. Look, are you kidding me right now? This is just, these are just lights, that's all that they are. But it brought me back to what my mom told me, and I've told you this several times in the past. I remember years ago, as a kid, five years old, four years old, trying to ride a bike, and I was frustrated, I kept falling down, I couldn't learn how to ride a two-wheeler. My mom said, Joseph, go take a nap or step away. Step away from the situation, son. Take a break. Settle down. Forget about it for a while. And then come back. Right, Gracie? Come back to it and it'll be all better. And you know what? That's what it did. So I took a break. Right, Grace? I had some, my favorite, espresso. So I sat back. Oh, thank you, Gracie. Had a little espresso. And I enjoyed that for about 10 or 15 minutes. And then I, what, oh, what's that, Grace? Oh, no. How back get in here? Grand Marnier? Oh, let's, put, let's put that back. <laughs> Daddy didn't show you that. Oh, it does relax you a little bit. But anyway, the point is, is what you know that it is. I stepped back from the situation, like you should do in most things in life, and said, come on, really? What am I hurrying up for? And I just relaxed, I came back to it, took my time, and it all worked out. Right, Gracie? And now we have that beautiful tree, right? Show everybody. Let's get out of the way here. Now you can go in there. Look at that tree. All right, folks, make it a great day. It's the only one. You want to wave? You've got... <laughs>